fluid connective tissue. This is histology of a blood smear. Remember, this is a connective tissue. There's three types of connective tissue. Connective tissue proper, that includes our loose and our dense. Fluid, which is our blood and our lymph, and then supporting cartilage and bone. So here we're looking at blood. And as soon as I see a bunch of pink bubbles, I know that's my blood because 99.9% .9 of all the formed elements of the cells in blood are erythrocytes. And erythrocytes are red blood cells. So all of these pink little bubbles that you see throughout the slide, erythrocytes, to transport that carbon dioxide and oxygen. Then I have little specks of dirt throughout, and I highlighted a couple of them as platelets, but just these tiny little specks. Remember, they're just fragments of cells. So these are platelets that we use for clotting. So platelets. And then our leukocytes, which are white blood cells, and there's different types when we get into the lymphatic system. Remember when we looked at formed elements of the slide, the cells, 99.9% .9 of them are erythrocytes. So only 0.1, depending on you and your health status, 0.1% are the leukocytes. So you don't see them as much relative to the erythrocytes. But what I can see is a lymphocyte in this color. So this dark colored staining material is a lymphocyte. And now we have a specialized system for that when we get into things like T cells and B cells in the lymphatic system. So a dark clear bubble is a lymphocyte. Platelets are my tiny dark dots. Neutrophils are my most abundant of my leukocytes, roughly two-thirds, 70% of all my white blood cells. There are first responders, so we see them more throughout the body. Yeah. Neutrophils, but remember, it's only 70% of 0.1% because our leukocytes is only about 0.1%, but again, it depends on your health status at the time. When I see these lobes to them and the way the cells are designed, this nuclei, as I look at the expansions of them, they look like little balls or lobes inside. These are neutrophils. So a solid dark dot is a lymphocyte. The ones that have like lobes or balls inside, these are neutrophils. Remember, you're looking at a fluid connective tissue.